So I found all the dark, the last dark crystal. Um, how do I transform Eric back? Take this outfit and don't worry, pretty head. Really? Ugh. Um, after all that, really? Um, we need to get scallops for her. Where do we get scallops? Um... I don't even see scallops ingredients, maybe. Oh, Dazzle Beach. Okay. Bring poor unfortunate Eric to Ariel. Dude, does that mean I need to take his statue? Maybe. Oop. Now, is he in my inventory? See if we can find Ariel. Oh, she's down at our house. So let's go down here. Maybe it wasn't the statue. Hi. What? Who is this? Hi. Oh no, Eric, how could Ursula do this to you? Sorry, my TV was on the whole time. Riley, please help us. We have to save him. You keep Eric safe and I'll go talk to Merlin. Don't worry, I got this. Oh, thank you. I hope Merlin can help us. Come back and see me soon. Okay, let's go ask Merlin for help. Uh, Merlin. Oh, I hope we can get Eric back soon. I really want to get him back. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Quit moving. All right now, we have work Prince to Eric was in the sea, which is clutches all this time. Oh, dare I see? She gave him back his freedom, but not his body. Oh, That's just what I'd expect from a scoundrel like Ursula. Always cheating to get what she wants. Tread lightly around her, Riley. Now, as look what happened. I was just reading a book on transfiguration. It may hold the key to changing Eric back. Yeah. <laughs> it's called Transfigure Your Troubles Away. How to Turn a Frog Back into a Prince in Three Simple Steps. Uh, how convenient. <laughs> there are no coincidences in Dream Valley. Subconsciously. I must have known to pull it out of my shelf this morning. Of course, Eric is not a frog, but he is a prince. This is so the same magic should apply. So what's the first step? Let's see. The first step when turning a frog into a prince is to build him a home fit for royalty. I suppose that means you'll have to start by making a house for Prince Eric here in the village. Got it. Build Eric a house. What's the next step? The prince needs some sort of object to anchor him to human realm. Once you've built this house, search it to find something important to Eric. Okay. Build him a house, find an object that's near and dear to his heart. Got it. What's the third step? According to the book, the final step is classic, Riley. True love's kiss. How romantic. I find it a tad silly myself, but there's no magic more powerful than love. It's Ariel's love that will restore Eric. Now, once you've found a suitable object in his house, bring it to her and have her call his name three times while picturing Eric as he should be. That should restore him. Then to make sure this spell is permanent, she'll have to kiss him soon after. Good luck, Riley. I take my hat to you. <sighs> okay. Um, so we have to place his castle somewhere. Uh, 
I'm running. I feel like I'm running out of room. Why did I do that? Oh my gosh. How big is this thing? Holy cow. Um... This is kind of my gardening area, but, um, yeah, and there's something in the way there. Um, we'd be moving that. We can't move that. Okay, we're just going to have to go get it. Okay, let's see if we can do this again. I don't really have another place that I can put it. So, we're just going to have to put it here. <clears throat> I mean, we may have to just put it like this way. Okay. Good day, dear. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. All right, find something near and dear to his heart. And that must be what it is. I just wanna look and see what it looks like in here. Oh, wow. It's really pretty. Very pretty. All right, let's go do this. <clears throat> All right, Ariel, here we go. Here we go, guys. That's Eric's flute. He was playing it the first time I saw him. Where did you get this? Will this help us save him? Merlin told me how to restore Eric. Hold the flute. Picture Eric in your head. Call his name three times, then seal it with a kiss. It will work. I hope you're right. Yeah. <laughs> Eric, Eric, Eric. And now I'll kiss him. Here it goes. Oh, Eric, I hope you can feel how much I love you. Please return to me. <gasps> Yay! We did it, you guys. Oh my gosh, yay! Um, I hate this because I always do the wrong thing. There we go. Nice picture. Thanks for coming over. Is it true? Am I really human again? Hey, hey, hey. I am, and it's all thanks to you. I don't know how I'll ever repay uh -huh. you. Oh, and just so you know, I was conscious the whole time bumping around inside your pack. You should really clean that thing out. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Wait a second. Where's Ariel? Is she okay? What did Ursula do to her? Ursula sent her to a deserted island, but she's safe now. She helped me rescue you. She'll be happy to see you. I've got to see her right away. Whoa! Wow. I'm so famished I can barely walk. I can't face her like this. Not after everything. I have to get my strength back first. No problem. I'll whip up a dish for you that's fit for a prince. How does... 
gazpacho, vegetable stew, and a fresh berry salad sound. That sounds incredible. Thanks, Riley. Okay. Oh, inventory's full. Uh I swear to gosh. Okay. Well, I already talked to Eric. Okay. So now we need to do that. Um, let's hope we have the ingredients because I have no idea. <clears throat> so, oh. Yeah, let's hope we have the ingredients. I have no idea. We'll see. So, recipes, we have to do gazpacho. We need an onion. Okay, what else says there? Yeah, we're going to need onions for all these, and we sold them. So we're going to have to make, get some more onions. Oh, except for that one. We can do... No. We need that. I think that's raspberries. Okay. all right so we're gonna have to plant some onions and I just froze that's weird okay It's not letting me do anything. It's frozen. If I go in with using my mouse, 